Regardless, if it's in a bottle or a can, I'm going to be reviewing a beer today, guys. Oh, BC's Beer Reviews. BC's Beer Reviews. Oh, BC's Beer Reviews. Hey, guess what, man? I'm doing a review, and I'm outside. That's right, man. It's like 51 degrees outside right now, man. Oh, my God. I could. Oh, man. I've been waiting for this day, man. The weather has been killing me, man, for real. Recording in the house and whatnot. Lord. <laughs> and, my goodness, I am glad that I am recording outside. And, you know what that means? I'm going to be recording a lot more outside. Well, let's get this underway, shall we? Well, you might be wondering, what do I got today? What do I got today? Now, give me a second, I'll tell you what I got. I'll show you what I got. That's right. And this one, from what I found out, has been around for a while. Okay. Now, I can't say how long these guys have been in operation for, but it's been at least three years. At least. And I'm assuming it more than three years. So, there's only one other review on this beer than what I'm going to do right now. And <laughs> it's another guy, from what I can tell, from Michigan as well. So, um, <clears throat> so the one, the thing I've got today is the Mitten Brewing Company's Docs No No Double IPA. That's right. Now, these guys are out of Grand Rapids, Michigan, okay, which is about here. No, no, no. Yeah, it's about here. Yeah, it's about here in Michigan, okay. Now, this is coming at you with an 8.9 APV and a 77 IBU, okay. Now, I looked on their website before I came on to do this, and they've got a ton of beers, ton of beers and oh my god uh, it see i mean they've got a lot i mean a lot so i mean it's one of them things now the, okay they're they were established in 19 or not 19 okay they were established in 2012 and it's okay 10 years okay 10 years okay nice and let's see here. <laughs> they got a thing on here where it says you aren't tripping docks. No, no. Is a double IPA with <laughs> erratic hop flavors and aromas that are out of this world. Okay. Okay. Well. Grand Rapids, Michigan. Double IPA. 12 food ounces. 8.9 APV. The Mitten Brewing Company. 540 Leonard Street. Uh, Northwest Site 8. Grand Rapids, Michigan. Check us out at www.mittenbrewingcompany.com. Okay, well, here we are. Got it. And this is a new one on me. I mean, I don't think I've done these guys before. I don't think that I can remember, but I'm going to have to go through my uh, videos to see if I have. But... <laughs> For argument's sake, let's say this is the first time I've done this. So, and as far as I can tell, this is the first time I've been good memory. I can only remember seeing this now. So, yeah. Well, <clears throat> it's killing me on how this tastes and smells. And I mean, hey, 
like I said, the Mitten Brewing Company out of Grand Rapids, Michigan. So, crack goes the beer can. Got my glass ready. Get the can ready. Oh, look at that. Okay. It's looking nice. Looking nice. Getting a nice foamy head on there. That's what I'm working with today. Getting about yeah, about a finger's worth of head on here. Okay, I'm getting some sweetness off of this. A little bit of pine. I'm getting more sweetness than I am pine off of this. Now this is kind of like a. I was, now it's just me, or is this like an orange, cloudy orange color? Okay. So, it's looking good. I can't see no carbonation out, off of this, which is fine. It's off white head. It's kind of dissipating. It's already like halfway down already since I poured the glass. Looking nice. Smelling nice. So, yeah. I mean, the Bly PA. Yeah. Enough of the jibba jab, but let's see how this bad boy tastes. Okay, nice. Nice. Enjoying that. Nice and balanced. Good mouthfeel. Getting some of that citra and a little bit of piney. Just slightly. Uh, lingering on the center of the tongue here. <clears throat> Lacing looks nice. Lacing looks nice in the glass so far. <clears throat> yeah, there's definitely a sweetness. I mean, Sweetness comes right at you. And that's when you start getting that pininess coming in afterwards. It feels like an equal balance of the two, which is nice. Enjoy the color. It's kind of like, yeah, like an orangey color, like I was talking about, cloudy orange color. Do it. <clears throat> yeah. It's looking nice, and the lacing's still holding up so far. So, yeah. Well, I actually enjoy this. Not bad. I'm, you know, I'm surprised I haven't heard of these guys before. Yeah, yeah. So, I'm actually digging this one. Oh, it makes me interested in the other beers that they've got in their lineup. For real. Let's see if I can buy some of this stuff online, maybe. Seen this in the group uh Liger store today. I was like, you know what? This looks like a good one to do. And so far, I haven't been let down by this so far. So yeah. Really good. No, if I, if I had to give this one a rating or a grade, I would have to give this a, a actually digging this. I really am. So, if you're in the double IPAs that are kind of, uh, I guess, kind of juicy <laughs> and piney, this is a good one. And it, you know, it feels like there's, I don't say, yeah. Okay, yeah. 
I would give this one a shot. I'm the, as you can tell, I'm thoroughly enjoying this one. So, yeah. <clears throat> well, like I've always said, hey, trade responsibly. Don't do this stupid. Peace out, brother man. Peace out, sister girl. And I'll check you out next time. Here, on the next PC's Beer Reviews. BC's going to drink some beers to so take a seat, baby, have no fear. He will certainly bring that cheer. So sit down and don't move that rear BC.